Carbon dioxide in the atmosphere increases the greenhouse effect. More thermal energy is trapped by the atmosphere, causing the planet to become warmer than it would naturally be. This is global warming. One way to slow global warming is planting trees and limiting our carbon emissions. Reimagining the levels is doing just that. I'm Kate Towers. I've been working with Reimagine the Levels now for two years. Reimagine the Levels came about after the terrible floods in 2014. Then I was asked if I would help with delivering a, a grant for Somerset Rivers Authority for Reimagine the Levels, which was great. I jumped at the chance. And we're working with Frag Southwest, which are the farming and wildlife advisory group. We deliver on ground actually happening, the tree planting, finding the sites, getting the trees and getting them to the people and getting them planted. And Frag are an advisory body. When we're planting, one of the things we have to be really careful about is not to plant on land that's already an important habitat. By planting trees, we introduce the required plants back into the environment that they were taken from originally. These trees do a lot for our environment by providing a habitat for insects and animals, as well as performing a process called photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is a reaction where a plant transforms sunlight and carbon dioxide into glucose for the plant to consume and oxygen as a byproduct that animals and people later use to breathe. As well as it being used by living creatures, the process removes excess carbon dioxide and water vapour. We should plant trees because they're fundamental to our ecosystem and they make up the air that we breathe. You see trees produce oxygen because they take in carbon dioxide, carbon dioxide which comes from the people that walk the earth, you know, and then we have oxygen to breathe. And I think with the growing population and with fossil fuels seemingly not going away, I think it's even more important that we're planting more so that we don't disrupt the equilibrium between what's man-made and what's natural. We also have to consider what is called the six pillars of tree planting. Air, water, biodiversity, health, jobs and climate. Air as a pillar is important because trees take out toxic pollutants and so clean our air. We consider water a pillar because trees filter said water, stopping floods, stopping land movements due to water. Planting trees increases biodiversity through them hosting many species of animals, plants and fungi. Trees improve the environment and so improve our health. They create jobs through maintenance and plantings as well as protecting the planted trees.